Okay, um, so I'm going to show you guys how to fix this issue. If you ever get this, uh, it happened to me opening Discord, uh, also opening a game, but it says this application requires Net Framework version 4.0.30319. Um, and if you're like me, this will be confusing because you know, if you Google this, it'll tell you a bunch of things, right? Go to um, Control Panel, Programs and Features, try and repair the Net Framework version. And if you're like me, it doesn't show up in Programs and Features because it's under this update for Windows 10. So you can't do that. Uh, it'll also tell you to go to Registry Edit. I'm sorry, not Registry Edit. Um, It'll tell you to do turn Windows features on or off, right? Give it a second here. And it'll say, oh, make sure you have this enabled, which I do have it enabled. And every t everything I would search would just lead me back to these two solutions. And it'd be like, oh, well, did you try restarting your computer again? Of course I tried restarting my computer. Um, but anyways, I finally found this solution. So this guy's a genius, right? It was so simple. Uh, I'll link to this in the description, um, but basically, you just need to save all of these registry items to a .reg file. So, here's what you can do, right? You can literally just copy this. That's My computer's just slow. Make a new text document. Right? Literally paste that in here and then save as, you know, save wherever you want. I'm putting in, in documents. Now, you could obviously name it whatever you want. I named mine as Net Framework Fix. I'm going to rename this one too so it doesn't give me an error. And then just save it as all files, right? save now in registry edit so to open registry edit um, you can either go in here and type run and open the run app or you know you could press the windows key and r at the same time does the same thing and you type reg edit enter let it make changes right and what you want to drill down under is this under h key local machine software Microsoft Net Framework. Oh, sorry, not Net Framework. So it's under Microsoft, and then it's this Net Framework, Net Framework Setup. And, like, when I was doing the troubleshooting, it was telling me to go here and check and make sure I have the release version and all this stuff, and that didn't help. But literally, all you have to do now is File, Import, go to where you saved that registry file. So mine was, what, Net Framework? Yeah, so then you just click on it, open, and it'll literally take two seconds. It'll import all of them. You don't have to restart. You don't have to reboot. You don't have to do any Windows updates, and it'll finally work. I was trying to play this game for so long, and it kept giving me that error. And literally, that was the only solution that worked. Um... So I just got to give shout outs to this absolute scholar, David Sherrill. This is the only helpful guy on the entire internet. All of Microsoft's people are of no help. They're absolutely useless. Um, I seriously, I, I can't believe this work and all these people also worked for them as well. Um, so I just want to share that. And also all the other YouTube tutorials for this issue are on like Windows 7 and... I just, even though they're uploaded in like 2022, I don't understand, um, but yeah, I just wanted to share because I can't believe this worked. So hopefully this helps you guys. I'll link to this, um, and if you guys have any questions, just let me know. But yeah, David Sherrill, absolute legend. Uh, I don't know where you're from, but if I ever run into you, uh, I'll buy you a beer or something. I don't know, but thanks guys.
why does it let these people moderation ban user? I don't want to see that. Oh wait, yeah, I do. What do you mean? 